Hello everyone, I am Sai Charan and I am from the team Code Crushers and my teammates are Vinayak and Vaishnavi. So today we are going to work on the creation of a Ghana landing page. Uh, so you all know pretty well that Ghana is a professional media, uh, music streaming website. So you can uh, find all kinds of music on that app such as hip hop, jazz and every content. And also your favorite artists uh, are also available on that app. Uh, it is a very professional app which allows you to listen music for free uh, so go check it out and now let's start creating a landing page for this Ghana website M means the landing page is the first page which you view when you open the Ghana website or any website a landing page is a first page which you view so let's open the VS code so I have already kept ready all the images and HTML um, files and everything uh, which we need for this creation of the Ghana landing, Ghana landing page. So let's start. So the code is uh, somewhat big. So I have, I have divided it into sections such as parts and I will paste every part here and simultaneously you will view the output so that you, you will un you will understand easily and the video will be short but you will understand everything so let's start with the first part so this is the basic layout of every html file so it starts with doc type html this is the first and mandatory line in every html code and then we have come to the head part which uh, where you have this tag called link tag where you can link your CSS file with your HTML file using this link tag. So I have given the title of this page as Ghana landing page which is precisely what, uh, what we are doing. And then we start with the header uh, where in the header we will create a navigation bar uh, where uh, there will be uh, the name of the app and some other contents like home, about languages, contact us, blogs, everything. And so this is about the first part. Let's go to the next part. So this is the next part where I have added a division called a drop down menu. This is a inbuilt division in HTML where uh, you can create a drop down menu for, uh, for anything. Here we have created a drop down menu for languages and its contents are Hindi, English and Telugu. So we have created this using list. List is a, uh, another important part in HTML where you can use these and create navigation bars and uh, you can give drop down menus and anything. So and we have also added another list such as uh, blog and contact us into the navigation bar. So let's go live to see the output till now. So this is the output. So we'll keep the screen like this till the end where you can view the code and the output simultaneously and you, you can also observe the changes in it. So this is the uh, name of the app Ghana and this is the navigation bar and this is the drop down menu which we have given for language and its contents. So let's proceed with the next part. So we have created another section here uh, called section class hero and in that we have created uh, various divisions uh, and we have given its name as hero content where uh, you have this uh, text called uh, unlimited music uh, and streaming. We When we have applied a break here which uh, allows the content to go into the next line. So this is the output till now uh, where we have I've also added a background image which is precisely uh, for a music app and I have also uh, kept a button here which uh, on clicking it you will go to the start of the page and also I have added some text here where like uh, discover your favorite song skate plays where which uh, ran um, every music website consists of so 
so uh, this is the text uh, which i have given it in the uh, p tag which is a paragraph tag so and also i have used here an anchor tag where we can give a button and anchor tag a class as button you see here yes and the text on the button as get started okay so let's go to the next part fourth part so this is the next part where we have added some divisions as division class container division class row and other and we have also given some images like this and i have also given some effects on it and also uh, where we can give the image in the html code using the img src tag and inside a division because uh, they are more uh, upcoming images where i should place so till now this is the and here i'll place the next two images till now this is the output and i have given some effects to it like hover effect means once you go on it see the image is getting zoom so and i have also added some text in it like personalized recommendations where uh, you can see in any music app it gives you some recommendations on music that you hear so so these are the this is the paragraph tag till now this is the output and let's go to the next part so the here is another division where which i have created uh, called the effect button and also uh, i have given an anchor tag to it uh, where it specifies the class of the div, uh, division as a button and i have added some text called read more over here and this is the image i have selected and this uh, so i have given hovering effect even to this and also the uh, we have is an image yes let's go to the next part so this is the next part just a minute guys yeah this is the next part uh where uh, i have given another image and some more text to it see this is the same image and i have given some text to it and i have also given here the same button called read more this is the same text and the the same code will be applicable for it just you have to change the image and text you want to write over there so let's go to the next part so uh, i have given another division class called column inside uh, the column class i have given another class called effect and placed there an image called effect.img and i have used the image tag to place it and this these images are already i have downloaded these and i have kept in these so you can even keep uh, images which you like and uh, which you think will be suitable for a land uh, music website landing page so and uh, i have also given some text in this too third image too so this is the image i have selected uh, where this is offline listening where you can download the songs and listen now we'll give uh, this read more button to this also so let's go to the next part just a minute so i have given the same effect as uh, this uh, to the uh, same uh, same effect to other two images also and i have given a button here so i have again uh, uh, given some text in the third image too and i have kept a button over there where you can see here so the button appears for three of them okay now let's go for the last part of the html so the last part of the html is the photo section where uh, you can see in an, any website uh, at the top, bottom of the la landing page where you can see uh, a copyright button registration uh, symbol or all rights reserved like that so i have given it as uh, it is default in every website so 
so for the footer parts contains this uh, which i have given it in a paragraph you can see it over here the text appears here okay let's go to the css code i'll show you the css code so as you can see here first uh, this star symbol is uh, known as a uh, universal selector in terms of html language so where you can uh, this star indicates that uh, you are mm, you are selecting the whole page and setting some effects like uh, margin padding etc so i have given margin 0 yes now you can see it precisely i have given the margin 0 for this the outline of the landing page padding 0 and box i have given the sizing of this landing page as a box so for this we use the command called box sizing and for the body means everything in the inside the web page i have given the font family as arial and the line height as 1.5 and now we go to the logo which is this also the logo is in the navigation bar so the effect applies well the color i have given is white and the font size as uh, 30 pixels then uh, when we go to the menu bar i have given menu bar uh, means this where i have the image this unlimited streaming and this button okay menu bar and i have uh, given some effects which i thought would be relevant for this where the background color of the text will be black the height will be 8px width will be 100 percent and display will be flex it is uh, flex is a effect in the css where you can highlight the text and also i have given the text position as relative so if we come down the menu bar which where uh, the unordered list uh, the lists are present i have given the font size for them as uh, 20 pixels color will be white as the same because uh, uh, it, the ui of every landing page is very important ui means uh, user interface where if you see the landing page of any site uh, you will be kind of attracted because of the theme used in it or the images used in it so for the ui of the landing page i have uh, selected uh, similar colors uh, which are easy to blend and also for the drop down menu uh, the display will be none like it is a simple drop down menu there is uh, no uh, kind of effect in it this is a simple landing page where you can learn then let's come to the header part header i have given background color as white and uh, i have given some padding out of 10 pixels because there should be space between uh, every word here in the header and also this is the header part uh, and this is dot hero content depicts the division hero content which we have given in the html file for the h1 this is the h1 uh, hero content h1 is this unlimited music streaming we have given the font size as 60 pixels because it should be visible uh, to everyone and the margin bottom as 300 pixels so if we go down uh, this is the code for the button used in the uh, used on the image called the get started so the display for this is in an uh, inline block where the inline block means where uh, the text the button is in the form of a block where the edges are curved so let's go down so the for the total uh, page we have given the line height as 1.15 i have tried the various line heights during this uh, as and i came to a conclusion that this would be an appropriate line height for the entire page so if we come to the body uh, i have given font family as roboto and sans serif 
so the if we go down the section title means all of the sections uh, will where i have given the position as relative and width has 100% so if we go down i hope you are understanding this and if we if we go down the effect of these images these are the effects uh, related to these images where we have uh, font size 0 that then if we give font size 0 it will uh, display a basic font size of, of every text in CSS this is overflow overflow is an effect in CSS uh, where you can uh, keep a specified text in, in confined to a specified area where um, I have given this text only in this box. It should uh, uh, it should be applied only to this box, and it should not come out of this box. So I have given this overflow. So if we go down, the effects of every images I have given some transition, like just say three seconds of all the images, and also I have given some hover effects to these images. So uh, these depict dot effect dot effect text before these depict the division class that is effect and in effect uh, we have given uh, we have given some uh, effects like border top border right where uh, this the borders of these where uh, it should not touch the border of this page so I have given a border uh right as three pixels so uh and also i have given uh, some frames which uh, i uh, which i uh, have taken an input uh, from my friends if uh, because this increases the uh, look of a web page uh, which it where you can view the web page uh, very easily and the look of the web page will be very good so this is the CSS code and um, uh, at last i have given the division container means dot container you can uh, you use the dot symbol for specifying the div class container where i have given it black means for these images I have given the background color as black because there is an image upwards and it should not interfere with that. So these are the effects I have used. So with these uh, effects and this code, we can create a simple Ghana landing page which will be attractive and also easy to understand. So this is the overall output. So this is the overall output where this is the drop down menu. This is a simple Ghana landing page. So thank you everyone and uh, for watching this video and this is Sai Charan from the team Code Crushers signing off.